Nurk, how you how you explain the second the second half effort and how what would you like to carry on on from tonight's game? I mean, I don't know whether we got to change, but something got to change. You can't just saying next one. Um, obviously, they made the shot, but made the shot most of the game. Felt good, felt confident. Um, I thought we have an effort, but at the same time, if something not working out, we just can't keep jacking ass threes. And I've been, you know, told this through the season, but um, I believe in this team. I know how much talent we have, but that means shit if we're not if we're not executing the way we're supposed to play together. It's going to be a long series, but at the same time, we can't just assume we're going to win because we are home. Next question is coming from Jason Quick with The Athletic. Nurk, what do you have to do to stay on the court longer? Got a trick referee. Bro. What they do, I don't know, man. It's my fault to get in foul trouble, but at the same time, I'm looking to fouls, and, and I can't agree on all of those, man. I really can't. I feel the four or four or fifth fouls. You know, Nicola is a great player, but he just grabbed my arm and 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 kind of holding my hand and they're giving me a foul, fifth foul. I think that's unacceptable in playoffs. If they have to have four referees out there, have a four referees out there. Um, you know how, you know, obviously I know how much I need, you know, staying in the court for my team. But at the same time, man, just sometimes they, we are home, man. We play home. It's crazy. Um, you know, I don't want to necessarily get fined and saying all the wild stuff. It's on me. I'm going to take this one. You know, it's a lesson. I'm not going to be in that position no more. But at the same time, they, they I feel like they, they got to communicate with us more. If I ask something, you know, I broke my leg two years ago for some reason when when people go into my, my shins and they, they're supposed to be penalized for fouls and those little guards getting away with everything. And when you have a people getting my hands, I mean, my legs, I don't know. I just feel like they, they're supposed to be uh, different looks especially with the, with the history with me. And, 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 and I know that they're going to be there. I, I'm not trying to get run them over. I try to avoid them. And when you have people slide and they still, you know, review and look, I don't know. I feel like you guys watch the game and, and, and have the same feeling. You know, I'm going to take this one and, and, and look at back what I did. And, and Saturday is a game. So obviously frustrated as, as everybody. Yeah. After game two, when you fouled out, have that in your mind in game three that, okay, hey, I've got my fouls. I fouled out in game two? Yeah, I believe so. I don't know. I don't, know. I don't remember that. Maybe I got to check out that one. Um, what was your question again? Sorry. I imagine it was a point of emphasis. Uh, for you after that. And yeah, you did foul out in, in game two. Um, but I, I imagine that you were frustrated with that. Were you thinking about fouls and, and staying out of foul trouble entering this game? Not really. I, you know, I think I, you know, try to keep away from the pain and, and, you know, sort of adjustment we made. And, you know, obviously I'm going to live with the, when you call them making all those threes, um, mm -hmm. is a, you know, like I said, he's an MVP with something you gotta live with. Um, but, you know, we try to defend the pain better than we did in, in the second game. For the most part of the game, I think we did. At the same time, you know, it, it just doesn't count if you don't win. Yeah. AJ McCord with Coin. Yeah, talking about those points in the paint, Nurk, you outscored them 54 to 30 in the paint tonight, but then you have that three-point shooting night that they had. How do you make those in-game adjustments? How do you coordinate that to say, hey, they're hitting from three and maybe we should give them some in the paint. Like what, what's the communication like with you guys? I think you're muted. Sorry, you're muted, Nurk. You hear me? Yeah, we got you. Thank you. Um, I don't know. Like I said, I'm not, I'm not a coach. I can't, you know, uh, just force to play the post-ups and in and out game. I really feel when I got the opportunity to play in the post, I'm looking for the players, not, you know, necessarily just score. Um, 
obviously I've been here long enough that people know who I am. But like I said, I, I ain't complaining about try to get more plays for me. I feel like we just need to play better basketball as a group. And, and I feel like when we share the ball, we pretty damn good team. But, you know, when you just pretend to try to just shoot a three or more threes, and when they're not failing, I feel like it's really tough to beat somebody. Before we go to the next question, I just wanted to announce that Dean is in the other room available. Next question is coming from Jason Cliff with The Athletic. Nurk, you know, Tonight, uh, Ennis played about five minutes at the end of the first quarter, and then Terry decided, you know, that wasn't working. And it looks like he's going to lean on you a lot in this series to be on the on the floor. Do you feel like you're prepared to play big minutes, you know, like 35, 40 minutes? This is, you know, this is what we play whole season. I mean, we try to stay healthy and try to come back. You know, I'm going to be ready. Um, we just... Like I said, this is the, the special matchup as, as far as what we need to do. Um, I'm going to win what I got, man. This team and, and, and organization and, and fans going to, gonna, you know, especially what role I've been given this year. So I'm going to play best I can in my role. And people don't understand, like, you, you sometimes you just have to do the little things. And mm -hmm. now I feel like I try to get energy and, and, and just the extra step for us. And, and it's not necessarily, you know, try to be over aggressive when, when it's not there. But um, like I said, I'm going to be ready for my teammates and team there for sure. Yeah. And, and just for clarification, on, on your fifth foul, when you were, you know, just had your hand up on Jokic, what was the explanation they gave you for why they called that foul? They said I was holding him, and that was not true. My hand, and if you go looking back in, in slow-mo, my hand was never grab anybody. He actually locked my arm and jumped, grabbed my wrist. So, and like I said, it, it just in one way, but that's like, the minute or the how many how many second I was in the game, just so many slips. The end of the the game, and it's on me. I gotta you know stay away from uh stay away from uh from uh, my hands gotta be seen. But you know I think that's a that's a big blow up for us. Yeah. 